no strength training police coming to arrest me for not doing my strength training. Have you ever wondered if strength training is really that important for running or life in general? That's what I'm wondering because I've been marathon training for three years, ran three marathons, and now it has become apparent that I will not get better at running or be able to prevent injuries if I don't do strength training. I don't like strength training. It's boring, it doesn't feel good, it hurts. That's the same thing, but I'm counting it twice. The thing is, training for a marathon, I run slow, so my long runs are gonna take hours out of my day. And then you want me to go back and do a full body workout? No, no, I'm done. I get home, I eat a little bar, I take a shower, and then I'm on to the next thing. I did enough. Enough is enough. Apparently, that's not true, because I'm in the position I'm in. I have no upper body strength. If you missed it, check out the fitness test video that I posted last week. It was a little rough, but since I dislike strength training so much, I know myself, I know myself, I have to force myself into it. So to do that, I'm gonna do one thing every week that puts me out of my comfort zone and that requires strength. So think CrossFit, horseback riding, snowboarding. There were hundreds of suggestions. We have plenty to choose from, but they're gonna get more difficult as time goes on. And if I don't strength train, I'm gonna be miserable. And that's how I'm gonna force myself to do it. So we established my baseline fitness. I also did a one mile time trial. Here's how that went. I'm trying really hard. My lungs are burning. I'm sweating and it is not hot out. Whoa, I forgot to say the time. That was my fastest mile ever. Nine minutes and 24 seconds. So now that we know my starting point, let's get into the first uncomfy challenge, which was yoga, which I thought, I thought yoga would be like easing into this whole, you know, uncomfy challenge thing. To me, a 5.30 a.m. yoga class is uncomfy for two reasons. 5.30 a.m. to wake up at like four something, that's basically nighttime. And it's a group class with people I don't know. Turns out, those weren't uncomfy at all. It was the actual class that was hard AF and I am so sore and I was pouring sweat. Nobody else was. It was nice and relaxing for everyone else, not me. It is 4.56 a.m. Today I'm doing my first uncomfy challenge and it is a 5.30 a.m. yoga class, which is uncomfy for two reasons, 5.30 a.m. and a group class. And I'm so unflexible and I'm probably gonna fart and probably have to poop. I didn't even have a yoga mat. It's so creepy here. So, okay, that's where we're at. Oh, cool, cool, thanks, thank you. Got a yoga mat yesterday, didn't even open it. I guess I should do that before I go to the class. <laughs> Obviously we live in the middle of nowhere and we don't have a lot out here, but we do have a yoga studio right down the road from us. It takes like five minutes to get there and then I'll struggle to open my yoga mat for a couple minutes and we should be good. <laughs> Another uncomfy thing about a yoga class is I don't know the norms. What do you wear? Am I gonna be hot or cold? Do you wear socks? Do you bring a water bottle? Should I have eaten more? Is it gonna be bright or dark? I'm so tired because the whole night I was up worrying about waking up at 4.45. So this is gonna be a little rough, but you know what? We're trying to get comfy being uncomfy, so let's roll. Ugh. We're going in. Can I just put it like this and then it'll flatten out maybe? Like this. Yeah. Okay. These cork things seemed really cool in the store and then. Yes, new yoga mats are just. The problem with yoga mats, it's an old one. Inhale and lift your left leg and right arm parallel to the floor. Do not lift that left leg higher than your torso. Exhale, inverted knee. Reach, root into that left heel. Breathe. Across the body to your right elbow. Then take it all the way back up. Reach. Then the knee. And as you exhale, bring it in towards the nose. Lower that right knee. Over your left shoulder. 
Knees, low forward, walk, step, low float, float, feet between the hands, inhale, sweep it all the way up, up and down slowly today. We, Erin, on our first day here, taking this. Yeah, I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we'd just lay here and stretch a while. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting to that part. Some days are a little more mellow, some days are a little more intense. This is medium. I thought this was intense. <laughs> Thanks, Carrie. You're welcome. My first official yoga class she done. She did it! Yay! I couldn't straighten my leg, but we did it. <laughs> oh, now it's raining. <laughs> I will say, I know I'm weak. I know I have no upper body strength, but that was really hard. My arms feel like noodles. My legs were shaking. I was dripping sweat off my nose while everyone else was just calmly doing the poses. I thought we would just do some nice calm stretching and breathing. Ah, nope. I think I'm gonna stick with it because I can tell, I can tell that I will build strength from it. I'm really delirious. But hey, I just finished my first uncomfy challenge. That feels pretty good. I feel like next time won't be as intimidating because I'm familiar with the space now and how it works and the people. Sometimes for me, it's just the not knowing all the little details that'll keep me from doing something, which is so weird, so weird. Maybe I'll get over that by doing this series. There's a lot of pros to doing this series, putting myself in uncomfortable situations. I just learned that I can use yoga to build strength. So I will be back there on Friday, 5.30 a.m. Sweating my butt off. Be nice if I could go back to sleep, but I have three little kids that I have to go back lunch with before I get ready to school and go to school, and then I have to head in and work and blah, 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 meetings. Ah! Okay, bye. Update. It is now 8.45 in the morning, and I am next level tired. Like, mm, not, not doing good. I have a lot of work to do. Um, just wanted to, just wanted to point that out. And I'm, it's probably just because I was up all night, you know, worried about waking up early. It's going to be a rough day. But you know what? I'm a little bit stronger. Got my muscles going. I don't even know what words are coming out of my, out of my mouth. Okay, bye. To me, that really put it into perspective how little strength I have. Especially upper body strength. Let me, let me demonstrate something here. Just doing this. Just putting your hands up. Barely doing it. Barely doing it. My arms are going numb. Sad. That's what that is. That's sad. Just put my arms over my head. So that's another thing these challenges each week are going to teach me. How weak I am. And doesn't everyone like to be reminded of that? Next on the list this week is our workout equipment should be arriving soon, today. So we're going to set that up and we're going to do my first official strength workout pretty much ever. Let's go. Okay, that was the first thing, survive. What's next? Fire hydrants. Piss. Taken away. This is actually really hard. Am I supposed to be wearing shoes? Can't wear shoes. Oh, just holding myself up. Okay, we didn't even get to the actual workout yet. Fire hydrants, side leg raise. Those will be great. Oh my God, I can't even do one. Ugh. Oh my god, yeah, five's good, five's good. No, my form is not good. Just keep it to yourself. Back leg heel raise. <sighs> Bored already. Whatever muscles that thing just worked it are strong because I didn't even feel that. I did a little bit, but not like the other things. <sighs> Lying leg kicks. All right. <sighs> Next up is jumping jacks. Fun fact about me is I hate jumping of any kind. Solid form. Seal jacks. What are those? Like that? <laughs> oh no. Like that. Oh, like a seal. Like that. Okay, got, got it. Air squat. Does that mean you jump? Uh, what, where does the air come in? You fart. Oh, that might happen. Oh, burning. Uh, sometimes that helps. Ah! Okay. Quick to 
tutorial. I totally know what I'm doing. Did not just need to watch a video on how to do a kettlebell goblet squat. Okay. Oh. My legs are shaking. Ugh. I felt my heart beat in my ears. I don't like strength training. This is boring. It's hard. Oh, I bet that's a great angle. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Wow, I can't wait till this is over. Ugh. Oh God, I don't think I can do it anymore. Defeat and wedgies, that's all I feel. Okay, what's next? Okay, we're well, out push-ups and the straps. Let's blast out 10 reps. Oh. Who designed these things? Satan? Oh my god. I swear, if I don't see progress, I'm not doing it. This is, I think, physically impossible right now. Just do it when I can. All right. One, yeah, one more set of ten. One more set. I still have to do planks after this. <laughs> okay. The sad thing is, I'm really trying. Like, so hard. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh my God, I smell so bad. It just like bent over and it like wafted out of my shirt. Okay, last thing, plank. Not happy about it, but I'm happy that it's the last thing. How long you gotta hold it? 15 seconds, three times. So basically like five hours. All right, so I need the feet things. Oh, this is, this is a good way to get hurt. Oh, my hip. Oh, it's cramping. <laughs> I hope I can look back at this and laugh and be like, wow, look how far I came. Bucky, can you help out for once? Literally, how do you do this? Yeah, they don't show you that on the internet. They show you, oh, just do planks. Just. Maybe you take your shoes off. Oh, yeah. Oh, now what? It's an exercise just getting in these. How about we start with that? Not three sets of 15 minutes, seconds. Yeah. All my muscles are just like seizing as I'm trying to do this. Oh, <laughs> yes. Uh, okay, all right, here we go. Uh. Oh my god. I think I just inhaled sawdust from the floor. Probably, but it's good. Alright. Okay. That's why I get this over with. Oh my gosh. <sighs> okay. One more after this. And then we're done. Go. 15 okay, seconds. Go. Uh. 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 Oh. Okay. Somehow I survived. Hopefully next time's easier. But I have a sinking feeling it's not going to be. 